On Tuesday, the Prime Minister has set out uh, the basis on which he wishes to renegotiate the relationship of this country with the European Union. I think that those are very reasonable points that he has covered uh, in his letter and the speech that he also made uh, on that day. And I hope those uh, negotiations will be successful because it's important to remember the essentials in all of this that uh, by, and more, by and large Europe has been a much better place since 1945 and the decisions that have been taken since then than it ever was before and you've got to be very old really to remember anything that did go before people uh, now really up to the age of 70 have probably only known a Europe which has been more or less at peace where there's no actual threat uh, of a world war and that is very important but so too is our economic future and you just have to think very carefully whether this country will be able to do as well for itself uh, as simply a market of uh, 63 million people uh, in a very competitive world um, as against being part of a 500 million market uh, which in terms of trade negotiations uh, can have much better clout. That's what we've got to think over and it has to be shown very uh, plainly to me uh, to suppose that that is a relationship which we should rupture.